In high school basketball, there's a ton of great scores, but there's a kid who's averaging 46 points per game and he's just a freshman. So who is this guy? We see crazy numbers all the time. Mikey Williams dropped 77 points in one game and a lot of other top players average a pretty good amount of points. Normally we see players average roughly to 30 to even 35 points per game. And that's crazy itself. And sometimes we even see players average 10 assists or even 15 rebounds. But the player we're going to be talking about in today's video averages 46 points per game as just a freshman on the varsity team. So let's waste no time at all and let's dive straight into it. Meet Marcus Robinson. You've probably never heard about this guy. And here's the thing, I have no idea whatsoever why no one is talking about him. Marcus comes in at roughly 6'1 and 180 pounds, and he plays his high school basketball for Finney High School which is located in New York. And as just a freshman in this recent year, he averaged 44 points per game. Last year was Marcus Robinson's second season on the varsity team, so he actually started playing varsity as just an 8th grader. But in this recent year as just a freshman, like I've stated many times, and I have to emphasize that, he was only 15 and averaging 45.8 points per game. And if that wasn't enough for you, he scored more than 50 points in 8 games this recent year. And currently he plays AAU basketball for the Virginia Panthers. And in January of 2020, he tied the single game scoring record with 65 points. I don't think he gets a lot of attention because he is a small guard playing for a very small school. But even though he's a small guard, he can produce big time points in a very efficient rate. He wound up scoring 65 points against Rochester Prep and this is what his coach had to say about him. It's crazy, but I know he has more in him. So those are pretty good words from his head coach because he is basically saying he knows he can do better. And it's not like he was a one year wonder. In the recent year as an eighth grader on the varsity team, he averaged 25.8 points per game. An eighth grader averaging roughly 26 points per game on the varsity level is nothing short of insane. And it was also stated that he scored more than 47 points in 11 games in the recent year. And this is what his coach also had to later add. His ability to take over a game is unlike anything I've seen in 23 years of coaching. In this 65 point performance, I want you guys just to listen to these numbers. He had 29 points in the first half and shot 23 of 41 from the floor. And he was scoring mostly only two pointers because he only shot two of five behind the three point line. But here's the kicker, he shot 25 free throws and made 17 of them. And if that isn't impressive to you, he also had 18 rebounds and seven steals. His coach stated, nobody even knew he tied the record. That was one of the worst nights he's had at the free throw line. Marcus is an 81% shooter. He was sick too under the weather. Before we go any farther, we just gotta clap it up and give this kid some props. He was sick and had a bad night and dropped 65 points. I don't even know what to say about that, so let's just continue on. Here's what an opposing coach had to say about him. Marcus strikes me as a guy who would be a really good player in any league. I don't know about scoring 50 every night because he would face bigger, faster players, but that stuff doesn't matter. As a ninth grader, he would be a key contributor. He projects as a pretty good player. A lot of time and room to grow grow at this stage. And that coach is completely right. The scariest thing about this kid is that he still has three more years of varsity basketball. He really hasn't even tapped fully into his potential yet and he's already averaging almost 50 points per game. What a kid. I just want you guys to really think about this. He can't even drive to his games by himself but yet he's averaging 46 points per game. I'm going to emphasize 46 points per game a lot because that is ridiculous for a freshman. I know a lot of you guys really don't know too much about this kid but I can almost guarantee you he's going to make a lot of weight in the up and coming years. If he averaged 46 points per game as a freshman, I can't even imagine what he's gonna do in the next three years. I wouldn't be shocked if he not only saw double teams, but even triple and quadruple teams. You're gonna have to put at least three or even four kids on him just to stop him and keep him in check. Do I think he could average 50 in the up and coming years? I don't know, it's probably possible, but they're gonna start triple teaming him very soon. With that being said, I think we can all agree, scoring a thousand points in a career is really good for a high school basketball player. Marcus and Robinson though scored a thousand points in roughly only one year. And just going back to that 65 point game, listen to this. The head coach said, I personally thought he did not have one of his better games. I've seen Marcus play better than that. So when I say something like that, I'm saying to myself, oh my gosh, 70, 75 is possible for this kid. It's not averaging 45 to 46 points per game that's really impressive about this guy. It's more the fact that he's doing it at such a very efficient rate. He's not a three point shooter. He'll even admit that. He's more of a slasher and he gets most of his points by free throws or even attacking the goal. Here's what Marcus himself even had to say about what his best ability 
abilities are in basketball. Getting to the basket and drawing fouls, there's nobody that can stop me transition. I really love the confidence from my guy because hey, no one stopped him yet. And like I stated earlier in this video, this isn't a one hit wonder. He's been doing this his entire life. No one's just talking about him. Here's what Marcus had to say when he was younger. When I was 13, I was playing AAU and I was putting up crazy numbers. I was like, whoa, so me and my uncle had a talk and he said, dude, you could be great if you just put your mind to it. I think he'll start getting more love on the college level if he puts up these numbers on the AAU level or the EYBL circuit. He plays for a very good AAU team, but due to Corona, you know, that really hasn't happened all just yet. He's still young, but he has stated that he would love to play for Duke and Coach K. I think the coronavirus has held him back from getting a ton of hype from social media and a ton of college coaches. This was supposed to be his breakout year for the AAU circuit, but it just didn't happen. And since he was putting up 46 points per game at a very small school, no one was talking about him. I truly think we'd have a completely different conversation if he was 6'7 or even 6'6. Six, six. But however, he is only roughly 6 foot 1, so he is a smaller type of point guard. And you guys know, smaller players are always underrated. That's how it is. Should it be that way? No, but it is what it is. Marcus is an absolute stud that we gotta start showing him some love. 46 points per game, guys. That's crazy. But keep in mind, he did this as a freshman. There's only one word to describe it, and that word is speechless. What he did is just speechless, and you can't even say nothing about it. Let me just put it in perspective for you guys. If someone averaged 46 points per game as a senior, that would be remarkable. And I guarantee you almost everybody in the country would be talking about that senior. But the fact that Marcus Robinson averaged 46 points per game, not as a junior, senior, or not even as a sophomore, but as a freshman on the varsity team is utterly ridiculous. And then to top it all off, no one even knows this kid's name. Come on now. Like I said though, he's still young, so he's got some time. He plays for a small school, so all of that comes into play. There's nothing left for me to really say about this guy. He's just a walking bucket. Some people in basketball are passer, rebounders, or even scorers, but this guy is the definition of a pure scorer. Layups, threes, free throw line, mid-range, however you want it, he can give you the work. I'm wishing Marcus Robinson the best of luck, and I hope he continues to put up crazy numbers and get the love and respect that he deserves. Let's be honest, with him receiving no love at all, he's almost getting disrespected. So going forward, I would like to see him get some of that respect that he has earned and get credit where credit is due. There's a guy averaging 46 points per game, but here's the kicker. No one's talking about him. So is he going to continue to put up these crazy numbers and finally wake everyone up? Or was this just a one hit wonder? But hey man, with all this being said, that's about gonna wrap up this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys learned something. If you're new to the channel, what are you doing? Join the family and hit that subscribe button and leave a like for more. And as always, let's be great. I'm out, y'all. Peace.